this up too. Yeah. Every one of these settings gives you a whole brand new car. No, on camera, it's gonna look like, oh yeah, no big deal. Look at the disco. Ooh, the disco looks good coming down there. Yeah. The Land Rover experience, man. We're about to jump in this uh, full size Range Rover, the one that made the brand famous in my neighborhood. Check this out. It's a net? Nanette. We're hanging out with Nanette. Now that's gonna be the driver today. Look at that. They're so nice. You even let my seat back for me. Alright, man. I'm gonna be honest with you. The inside of the new range is like every new range. It's amazing, man. Really great interior, man. It looks very, very new. It looks just new technology in here. I gotta put my seatbelt on, so oh, hold on. I wanna know. I wanna know the coolest, craziest stuff. So one been. of the coolest things I think with these vehicles is they have what we call terrain response. Mm -hmm. Where it's as easy as look outside, what do you see, and match the picture here to what you see outside. Got it, okay. Now every one of these settings gives you a whole brand new car. So they're gonna start you in different gears, change the shift patterns, okay. change how to touch the gas, the brakes, the steering, the traction arm, every one of those brand new car. Got it. If it's too much pressure, you push that down, it's an auto, it cycles through what it thinks you need at the moment. Does all wow. the for you. That's the, that's why the Grand Rover brand does what it does. That's why so many people love this car. They've made off-roading easier for a long exactly. time. Look at this, man. Look where we're going. And I know on camera it's going to look like, oh, yeah, no big deal. Right, and trust me. It. Trust me. I'm going to see. you probably hear my response, man. So one of the things they added is this button where you can actually see the degree of the incline you're on. Okay. So right now, not impressive. We're three degrees in the front. Perfectly Check that flat. out. You're going to feel what 20 degrees is coming up that and what 24 is off the backside. So 20 up, 24 down. Yep. All right, man. Which the numbers nice don't disco. sound impressive, but you feel look it. Look at the disco. Ooh, the disco look good coming down that hill, too. All right, man, let's see. So you're going to get a view of just the sky. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to keep it at my head level so you can All see. Right. Oh, man, yeah, this is like a roller coaster. All right, and on the way down, we're going to take advantage of hill descent control. Okay. So there's a target speed for each gear to not let the car go past. So we're going to set it for the huh. lowest one so we go down nice and controlled. Got it. So we peek first, make sure there's not a person down there, a car down there. Alright, you ready? Oh yeah, that does. It feels weird already. Alright, so I'm going to take my foot off the brake and I'm going to put my foot on the floor. I'm not going to touch the pedals. Uh -uh. Yeah. So right now I'm on the brake. I'm done. She, dude, she ain't got a foot on nothing. She's not touching any of the pedals right now. The car is doing everything. Well, the vehicle's doing everything right now, right? Yep. Does not let us get past that target speed. Oh, get out of here, man. Now, that's cool. That was crazy. I did not expect that. It's really cool inside the car. It's a warm day here, and they're out here driving at low speeds, creeping and crawling around on these little crazy tracks. I mean, dude, look at this. It's like if I opened the door, I would fall out of this car right now. You guys have to understand. Like, we're literally... I'm, I'm holding the camera funny and they're running it man it still feels like we're in like an, a luxury car it looks you like are. you know for brand recognition like we're in a jaguar right now it has that feeling that Same vibe company. of a luxury of course i meant for brand recognition you know i could have said benz but you know, but, you know. i want to let <laughs> you know you. i know what's up too and we're sitting here on a 45 degree angle actually okay it felt like 45 <laughs> doesn't it <laughs> jesus it's 26 guys and it looks like we're on a like a 45 degree slant i'm not joking pay attention. wow so this part's kind of fun. The ground drops off on the left. We're pressing over a little hill here. So this front left tire is not going to be touching the ground. So okay. now that front end's going to come down. Whoa. And we found the ground. We keep going. I'm going to take a little side tilt here just because we can. Now, did they make you a driver because you're a woman and they really wanted to prove to the guys? <laughs> we had to get that one. <laughs> had no. to get a, had to get a lady out here to let y'all know, man. Look at this, man. I mean, I really wish y'all could feel what's happening right now, man. But you can't kind of see what's happening on the screen. And understand, this thing is twisting and turning. Look at where we're headed. All right, so if you can see that, we've got a little hill on the left that yes. drops down. We've got an opposing one on the right. Uh -huh. So there's going to be one point there where this front left is up in the air. Okay. Where it teeter-totter as that back right comes up when the front goes down. Okay. Let's so see. We'll see Let's, if we I want to feel that. Because I'm not an off-roader. But this makes me feel like even if I wasn't an off-roader. You could still do it. I could probably still do it. Oh, definitely. As long as I'm going slow. All right, so my front tire isn't on the ground. We're gonna see it climb up a little bit more still. And because of the air suspension, we're still pretty level. Yeah, what's so, tires this doesn't feel there. like we're driving over that. How, how high do you think we are? I have no clue. We'll, we'll find out when we come down now. Whoa, okay, I feel you, I feel you. you okay, go. got it swaying and rocking around here, man. You're gonna get a little bit right here too. The front side's gonna come up on your side. 
and then come back down, and you got it. Now you're on all four again. Now it's easy. Wow. And it was easy. It felt like, you know, just point and shoot. It, it's a really, really amazing platform, as it's always been, man. Y'all know Ranch Rover, Lane Rover have always been at the top of that off-road grid because they give you all the capabilities of a really cool little car. I mean, a really cool little off-road, like a Jeep or something, a bigger, more luxurious package, man. And it, it's just grown over the years, and it's really cool to see what's happening. That right there, though, is my favorite one. The Velar. The Velar. Oh, that thing is beautiful. And we do all of this no problem also. So you're saying that big pretty range right there, the Velar, the one, if I'm going to buy a Range Rover, y'all, it's going to be the Velar. Trust me on that. Can do everything we just did. Everything the big, we just did. huge, more. Is this, so is there anything more capable about this car than the rest of the lineup? This car versus the Velar, the benefit is we have low range, so we have more torque. So okay. We can kind of pull through it a little bit easier. More truck like. More truck like. A little, a little more, more power instead of the speed. Where that one has only got higher range, where everything happens a lot faster. Got it. And we've got the air suspension in this one. We got a little more ground clearance than we get in the Velar. It has so air no suspension, air, but not the same. Not the same ground clearance. So when you're trying to go off road, off road, and you want to be luxurious, it's going to be this one. Yep. When you're the weekend warrior like myself, who's going to do it maybe once in a lifetime in a car, you get the Velar. Yep. Cool. Bit more space, you park a little easier. Just to give you a better understanding of the, the Land Rover Range Rover setup, man. She's from Chicago. You know what I'm saying? Chicago, you know what I mean? Are you, okay? you know what I'm talking about? Good to see you, Queen. Good to see you, Queen. You know what I'm talking about? Over here doing the big Rover Land Rover. I see you.